So I'm going to show you how to do a route planner. And this is a little known feature of Google Maps. And so inside Google Maps, instead of just getting directions from one point to another point, you could actually get directions from one point to second point to third point to fourth point to fifth point. And you could just keep adding stops onto your route and then you could reorder your route. And so it's a little known feature which is really useful. And to use it, you need to go to Google Maps. <laughs> That's where you start. When you get to Google Maps, you click on this little sign post with an arrow on it, and that's how you get directions. And you choose your starting point. So let's say I'm starting at Fresno City College, right? That's where I work. And, uh, and then when I leave Fresno City College, maybe I wanna go to, you know, uh, I don't know, maybe I wanna go to Fig Garden Swim and Racquet Club and go play some tennis. And so there's my first route. And then I could click right here to add another destination. And so after that destination, let's say I wanna to go to, you know, my buddy Kenny, Kenneth Hallstone's house. And so I go see Kenny. And then after going to that destination, I could go out to the annex and get something to eat. And then from there, maybe I wanna go get my van worked on a diamond auto body. <laughs> I don't know. And, uh, and then from there, you know, maybe I want to, right, go to, uh, you know, five restaurant and uh, have a, a beer with a buddy. So there, there are my routes. And then I think, you know, I think I'd really actually rather see Kenny before I work out because that's going to save me a little driving time. And it just switched my route right there. And uh, so I went from City College to here. I guess it'd be better if it was like a little bit further out instead of right back onto the same line. I don't know, let's say I'm going to the airport. Uh, Fresno Yosemite International Airport. Let's add that in there too. And uh, I'll put that one second on the list. And there, right? So you can see kind of now it did some, you know, routing around the town, showed me how to get around. Anyhow, that's how you can create a route with multiple stops. If you're in my class, so if you're watching this on YouTube, you don't have to do this. But if you're in my class, this is your assignment. Create a route with multiple stops. Take a screenshot of it and upload it. And if you're just on the web, make sure you check out our website, greatercommons.com. We're building it right now, but by the time you're watching this video, it should be up. It's awesome, great stuff. You can learn, learn, teach, the whole deal. Go look at greatercommons.com.